In 2012, Christian vocalist Wes Morgan penned and sang a song about the choice of worship entitled, I Choose to Worship. Worship is indeed a choice, not a mandate, nor should it be mechanical. Worship is choosing to recognize the goodness of God and getting lost in His presence. Lost in His goodness, lost in His mercy, lost in His kindness, lost in His love for you and for me. In the town of Bethany, there was a close friend of Jesus who knew all about worship, Mary. In the 12th chapter of the Gospel of John, Mary broke her alabaster box of spikenard, a very expensive oil, and she bathed the feet of Jesus with the oil, and she wiped his feet with her hair. She too wanted only the best to define her love for him. It has been speculated that this jar may have been Mary's dowry or her inheritance. In other words, this jar of spikenard may have been all she had of value, and she poured it out on Jesus. Her extravagant gift is a picture of the kind of offering expected of each of us. Only the best was worthy of her Lord, and she was willing to give everything as an act of worship. How much does your worship cost? In Mary's case, the smell of extravagant worship filled the house. From the smell of Mary's worship, everyone knew she had been with the Lord. From the smell of Jesus, everyone could tell that he was loved and worshiped. In ancient times, people didn't bathe every day like we do today. So it is speculated that Mary got up the next day still smelling like worship. In just a few days, Jesus would be crucified. Scholars speculate that as Jesus made his triumphal entry into Jerusalem, he still smelled like spikenard. He still smelled like someone loved him for real. As he was arrested, he still smelled like someone loved him. As he was beaten and mocked, he still smelled like somebody cared. As he nailed his hands and his feet, he still smelled like there was a worshiper somewhere. Mary anointed Jesus in advance of his death and burial. Mary praised and worshiped Jesus in advance. Jesus definitely got up from the grave. Oh, yes, he did. But Mary chose to worship him in spite of what may or may not happen. Mary chose to worship. I challenge us today to choose to worship our Lord and our Savior, Jesus, the resurrected Christ. My name is Roosevelt Williams, a senior pastor at St. John's African Methodist Episcopal Church in Montgomery, Alabama. Come out and visit us. We're located at 807 Madison Avenue, Montgomery, Alabama. Come out and praise the Lord with us. We hope to see you there.